Hello guys, how is everyone doing? So since in the last video, some of you guys requested that I do an iPhone version of the phones as a webcam for Zoom. So guess what? I went ahead and buy my own iPhone. See? All right. So I'm just joking. I already have iPhone and this is my iPhone 6s plus that I used um, quite a while ago and you guys might have a better iPhone than me a better version better quality camera so you guys might have a better quality video as well I would really appreciate if you guys give me a like and a subscribe if this video helps you out in any kind of ways it is my um, short-term dream to achieve 1000 subscribers and I hope you guys will help me out so it's easier than expected to do this in the iPhone. You just need to install a few apps and then go to your laptop and install the drivers and you're good to go. So unfortunately, I can't find a USB method for this way, but all these are using Wi-Fi connection. So make sure your Wi-Fi is good and make sure your laptop and your phone is connected to the same Wi-Fi. So first of all, go to your app store and search for Epoch. So there's a premium Epoch camera app as well as a free version. So the free version is already and good enough. You can use it for Zoom. So just install it. And then you go to the kinoni.com to download the drivers for the Epoch cam. So it can be downloaded in the Mac or Windows. So go ahead and download and install and follow the process. After that, just go to your Zoom and click on new meeting. So when you start a meeting, the default internal webcam will appear. So make sure to start your web, um, your app, Epoch app, and, and then go into this. Beside the stop video, there's an arrow button. Click on it and then you will see a bunch of sources that you can change. So the Epoch cam, try, there, there are two sources. So just try. So as you can see, it is right now connected to the rear camera, unfortunately. So to connect it, so to connect it to like the front facing camera as well as the audio, you need to buy the premium version. So the free version can't. So right now I'll be showing you another app or another method. So I believe that this app is better because there's a front facing camera as well as the real facing camera. So it's called Iron Webcam. Just search and download in the app store. It's completely free. And then the same thing, go to iron.com in your laptop and download the drivers for Windows or Mac. So after following the process and installing, Go back to your Zoom. Sometimes it won't work for the first time. Just restart your Zoom or restart your laptop. And just go to the same place, the arrow button, and from Epoch Cam, switch to the source Iron Webcam. And it should be able to work. And make sure you are going into the Iron Webcam. After it connects, it will work. So this is the front facing camera as you see. So it's a front facing camera. You can also switch it to the rear camera over here. Sorry. So you can switch it to the rear camera as well. As you can see now it's the rear camera. If you have a bookshelf or a tripod you can just mount it on it and video stream. And finally, thank you for watching. And if you find this valuable, make sure to give me a like. And if you have any problems or questions, feel free to comment down below and I'll help you as best as I could. Thank you for watching.